When you've set up and packed up this truck as many times as Patrick Harrell over the years. Last week I did 27. 27 in a week? In a week. It might be easy to take it for granted. You become accustomed to it. But not when the stakes are this high. I never get tired. Why? It's always invigorating. I love this. I'm passionate for this. I want to send guys home every single day. The 3M Executive Senior Fall Protection Specialist brought his truck, tips, and training to London Construction's redecking site along I-41 in Nina. Carell used ropes, carabiners, harnesses, and weights to provide a hands-on interactive understanding of improving safety standards, equipment, and the serious risks all construction workers, especially bridge builders, face. They don't realize how much force they generate when they fall a short distance. We don't have that fear of that height. We don't realize how dangerous it actually is. Harrell says 25% of all deaths from falls happen from a height of just 10 feet or less. You could fall off a stepladder and have serious consequences. Knowing that, Lunda Regional Manager Brad Diener knew it was high time to have Harrell present to his Wisconsin crews for the first time ever. Kind of combat that complacency that you get when you're so used to a risk that's out there that sometimes you might not take the steps. While about one third of all construction industry deaths happen due to falls, many of those come days, weeks, even months later. Harrell says workers are surviving the initial fall, but suffer blood clots, heart attacks, and strokes due to hanging too long in a harness waiting for help. This is a team work environment, so if you're not taking care of your teammates to the left and right of you, you're failing the team. As this team went back to work, Harrell packed up his truck to head to Milwaukee for another session, hoping the final message he left with the crew sticks with them forever. Safety is a benefit, a privilege to have because people have bled over the years for us to have what we have today. It's their responsibility. It's up to them to make sure they go home. Nobody else. In Nina with the WTBA, building a better tomorrow today.